The Texas High School Project aspires to ensure that all students graduate high school college ready, career ready, and life ready. THSP works toward this goal through hands-on learning, a cornerstone of the Math, Engineering, Technology, and Science Academy, METSA, at R.L. Turner High School. The academy, located in the Dallas suburb of Carrollton, uses a project-based approach to give its students not only technical knowledge, but a clear understanding of how to succeed in the college and career paths they choose. In project-based learning, uh, they're held accountable for doing group activities, and um, it gives those students the social skills because they're stuck in that group. They don't really get a chance to say, you know what, I don't want to do this. I mean, this is for a grade, so let's go ahead and do it this way. And so they gradually learn those skills in order to, uh, to communicate. And then hopefully, is what we hope for them to do, is to take those traits over to the real world and, and then apply them. And according to Megan Sanders, projects at METSA aren't focused on one type of learner. It's for all learners, and it creates uh, the... I think it creates the need to find out the information and it creates the relevance, um, the need to find the information and want to find the information and want to learn. Through teamwork and project-based learning, METSA students increase their understanding of how to succeed in college classrooms and eventually in the workplace. I believe you can interact with other people and it helps you better because you can learn from other people like, and you can use people's strengths and weaknesses doing the project and it does help like in work life too because then you're going to have to work with other people. You get grades based on your peers, your group members that you work with and uh, the teachers also give you a grade for what you've done, what you've worked on. But also your peers give you a grade saying uh, did he do what he was supposed to? Did he complete his tasks? Did he turn things on time? Was he a leader? Was he showing us what to do? Was he helping us? They, they, they give us, they grade us on that. Uh, where will we get the outfits from? METSA employs almost exclusively first-year teachers to implement project-based learning, a new concept on most high school campuses. We decided to go with a combo approach. And we have one teacher who has had 10 years of experience and that she met in the physics class. Um, but he has been doing project-based learning like you and I have been doing in our classes, so we knew that this is nothing new to him. The rest of the teachers, we decided to go with brand new teachers and teaching them the tricks of the project-based learning. It's easier than I'm teaching the traditional, um, I guess, methodologies that we all bring to the classroom. So you're doing ten times Students and teachers recognize the project-based approach as one that gives them a variety of skills, all of which help them become life-ready and able to achieve success through graduation and beyond. It's definitely preparing them for the next level, and I think that these students will be more prepared than anybody else will be just for the next level of their life. So whether it be college or the workforce, they're going to be 100% ready to do that. How are you creating the leaders at METSA strive to serve as role models while leading students toward their individual goals. We want them to see that what we're expecting of them is no different than what we're expecting of ourselves. All of us are actually continuing our education and the kids are aware of it. Um, so they know that's the expectation, but more than anything else we want them to feel that as a expectation for themselves. Really listen to the students, I think is the most important thing. So when they come into the classroom, they feel like, okay, this is our home. This is our classroom. We, people listen to us here. People care about what we think. And so I think when they are doing the work, they take more pride in it, and they feel like they feel more responsible for their learning, I think.